Welcome to Gray on Math. We are asked to solve this problem. We have a semicircle and a right triangle inside this rectangle. And we are required to find the area of this shaded region. Okay, so first thing we need to do is we need to get this hypotenuse of this right triangle, which is also the diameter of the semicircle. Okay, so to get the hypotenuse, we label this as C. So C is equal to the square of 12 square plus 16 square. And that would be C is equal to the square of 144 plus 256. And C is equal to the square of 400. And C is equal to 20 units. Okay, so from this we derive the radius, which is 10 units. This should be 10 also. And we, next is we draw a horizontal line from the center of this semicircle towards the left side of this rectangle and downwards also from that point. Okay, so next is we get this length by comparing this smaller triangle with the largest right triangle. Okay, so for that side, we have labeled this to label that as A. So A over 12 is equal to 10 over 20. So A is equal to 10 over 20 times 12 so this is one half and this becomes 12 over 2 a is equal to 6 okay so next is we get this length this length and we compare this smaller right triangle with the biggest one Okay. okay, so x over 16, maybe this x, so we have equal to 10 all over 20, so x is equal to 16 times 10 over 20, which is equal to 1 half. And the x is equal to 8. So that then equal to 8 units. Okay, so next is we get this length. This length is actually equal to the radius. Minus, this is the radius. Then, if you project this length, 6 unit length. And this length would be actually 10 minus 6 so that will be 4 units and for this length this small length here that is equal to 10 also minus 8 so 10 minus 8 is 2 okay so for the final step we have the area is equal to uh, 12 plus 4 which is the area of the rectangle, I, I mean the width of the rectangle times the length, which is 16 plus 2. Then we have to subtract the area of the semicircle, which is minus 1 half times pi times 100 or 10 square. 
and subtract the area of the triangle which is one half times the base times the height okay so simplifying further we have this equal to 16 times 18 minus one half times 100 this is 100 so this becomes divided by 2 so we have a 50 by then we have subtract this this becomes 8 times 12 96 okay, so simplifying we have 16 times 18 is equal to 288 minus 96 minus 50 pi and 288 minus 96 is equal to 192 minus 50 pi square units and that is our answer so thank you for watching until the end of the video please like the video if you like our solution and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.